Hi guys, Max Schenk here, and I want to talk to you about my new initiative, Five Minute Flow. Uh, I've spent basically the last decade trying to help people find a way to get healthier, stronger, more flexible, that sort of thing. And I've often given people a lot of homework to do at home uh, in terms of exercises and nutritional advice and things like that, ways to help them get better. And the most unfortunate part about that was that no one actually did it. So my new initiative, Five Minute Flow, is taking something very manageable and making it an everyday habit. Five Minute Flow is basically first thing in the morning, as soon as you wake up, you get out of bed, you move around for five minutes, and then you drink two big cups of water. Those, in terms of absolute bang for your buck, such a little time investment is going to increase your health, strength, and flexibility much more than it would if you just did it maybe like once a week or something like that. So this five minute daily habit is hugely powerful and I've already seen tons of people make huge strides in their strength, energy levels, and flexibility just by doing five minutes a day. So I wanted to show you guys today a couple of ideas in terms of what to do with those five minutes because I know some of you might be a little bit confused. Basically, if you're totally confused on what to do, you can make circles with all your joints because joints just happen to love circles. So you can move your head left and right, you can rotate side to side, up and down. You can make big circles with your shoulders. You can do both at a time or one at a time. You can make circles or figure eights with your wrists and your elbows. You can make circles with your lower back. You can make circles with your hips. Just don't make eye contact with anybody when you do these, otherwise it's a little weird. You can make circles with your knees and circles with your ankles. So if you're super confused, that's a pretty good way to start. Get all your joints moving early in the morning. Beyond that, there are a couple of things that I really like to have people do within that five minutes. But it's important actually that it's unscripted because I want you to use your brain a little bit and be creative. This is also part of why five minute flow is so good first thing in the morning is you have to work that creativity a little bit. So, number one, we do sit down quite a bit, more than we're designed to, so you wanna do something that's gonna open the front side of your legs. So, whether that's down here, opening up the hip this way, or simply reaching this way and reaching the hip up this way, as long as you're working some sort of hip extension or disassociation, so one forward and one backward, that's gonna go a long way, and then you can still make circles in any of those positions. The next thing is spinal twisting. So a lot of people who have tight shoulders, tight neck, tight low back, their mid back is really the culprit causing all these problems. So anytime you can twist or rotate, whether that's standing or down somewhere else on the floor, and that deep lunge with rotation right there is actually one of my go-tos because it addresses the hips and it addresses the thoracic spine, that rotation. So even just starting out with a couple of those, regular squats, lunges, whatever, um, just kind of explore the space and use that five minutes however you like, and that's kind of part of the deal. So trust me, it's well worth the time. Five minutes, two cups of water, every day or not at all, and uh, go ahead and get started and let me know how it goes.